The heat is on. The heat is on. on. It's on the street. So guys, welcome back to the channel and the pie touchdown series. So I've moved out of the the fishery bungalow that I really liked and I was meant to be checking into here today. Um, riverside bungalows and it's really nice but I've got here and there was some Italian girls here and I've got here and they have told me that the guy doesn't want anybody staying here his mum's in hospital and he's told told us all to find a new place so yeah the girls have just gone to find a new place so I'm gonna go back to where I was before I'm lucky that they're still got rooms there for tonight this is it the golden hat bungalows right on the river would have been cool for a couple nights stay would have been nice I think I was in this one so we're not gonna be able to stay here which is a shame because I wanted to try somewhere different but I just hanged around a little bit hello Hi, how you going? good so is Bum not coming back um, I saw this morning he's just taken his mum to hospital yeah the girls just said um, he's told them to find a new place they was checking in as well and I was meant to check in this morning as well and there was two girls here they said they spoke to him and he said sorry they and might be full though did you make a booking yeah i think they did as well right it's okay did um you pay no i've not paid no which is a good thing how much are they charging for the one up there uh i 900 baht for two nights so, so 450, 450 yeah that's all right because i think that one's a bit i think that's the nicest one really yeah i think it's the more the most modern one well, I'm assuming oh, I, I was in this ins one. I haven't seen inside. No, I'm, I'm assuming because people are in these two. Well, Is it a balcony. nice quiet place here? Quiet. It's lovely. Great. But I, I can't um, wait around really. If if nobody's here, I'm going to move on. Right, guys. So I'm on the way to Bamboo Bridge. The, the hotel that messed up earlier, I'll tell you about that later on because, yeah, I had a bit of a commotion with the hotel. But I've ended up coming to the bamboo bridge and we're going to check this out and yeah look who i've bumped into on the way you're never going to guess who anybody know this character anybody know this geezer vlogging a dead horse sean amazing channel man and i've been wanting to meet him for a while and i just bumped into him didn't we yes i'm bumped coming yeah he was coming back i was going up bamboo bridge so yes yeah, cool to meet man if you haven't seen his channel, check it out. I'll leave it on the screen and down in the description. This guy gets around everywhere, man. More than me, I take my hat off to him because he goes around vlogging. And we're pretty similar, I think. I, I think we are. We just yes. don't, we just <laughs> every day doing whatever. So yeah, yeah it's a big surprise, man. That's and cool. Yeah, he was been in Chiang Mai. Same here. Yeah, yeah Chiang, Chiang Mai for a few days. Yes. Yes. yes, I saw I saw Wayne yesterday as we were going in different directions. Yeah, he seen me, so. And then when I come down the bridge, yeah. I spied him. So I thought, really is that good. him? I had to look three <laughs> times, and I just knew it was because I know the heart, man. Yeah, <laughs> so that's cool, right? Check his channel that's out. Good. I'm sure a lot of you know his channel anyway, because you always comment on my channel about <laughs> vlogging a dead horse. So yeah, cool, man. Pretty I'm going to get up to the bamboo bridge in a bit, and. Sean's gonna take off doing some other vlogs. So the yeah, canyon. I'm off to the canyon. Uh, yeah, I done the canyon yesterday. It's good, man. Oh, yeah, but it's I'm, good. I'm not looking forward to. I'm scared yeah. of heights. Yeah, it's crazy. So it's big, the walkway. Vlog. Yeah. Yes. So yeah, catch Sean's <laughs> channel. I'll catch you in a bit, guys. Awesome. So how's about that then? I'm at the bamboo bridge on one of the worst roads I've ever been on in Pai, and I go past Sean vlogging a dead horse. So yeah, we stopped, had a good chat for about 45 minutes and hopefully we're gonna meet up tonight maybe for a drink in pie and yeah we gave each other a shout out so it was cool meeting Sean man 
see the places you never expect you come across people it's that's what vlogging's all about and that's what i love about it so we are at the bamboo bridge pie baby and it was a shocking road coming up here i thought lucille was going to bottom out or something but we're here man and we're going to do this tourist hot spot one of the most famous places in pie Ah, it's a beautiful setting, isn't it? Lovely setting. So I've only brought one battery with me, so I'm gonna have to be pretty quick sharp here, actually. So we got to pay 30 back here, guys, which is not a bad deal, is it? Copcon cap, thank you. Not the worst deal in the world. And we're going to check out this bamboo bridge that once again i've seen on a million vlogs before now i'm here can you adam and eve it just show you a bit of the bit of the mountain view yes yeah, so me and sean are going to be doing vlogs all about the same time in pi i reckon but it's all good man isn't it it's all good we're here at the same time there'll be Two more extra pie vlogs going up. Two more vloggers. Right, so we got like gift shops on the way round. Cool little gift shops. That's ah, cool, man, isn't it? It's, I didn't think there would be coffee shops in that on the way round. I just thought it was a bridge on what I've seen on other people's. So we're not going to walk all the way around. Just going to give it, give it a whirl. Yeah, and it's hot again, man. It's hot. This morning was so cold. I was, I was shivering this morning. Let's take a look in this way, shall us? That's a cool tourist attraction, right? Probably a place you'd only come once. people working in the fields that's what I've that's what I've like liked the most about this trip just how sort of real Thailand it is up here I know it's pie and it's not real Thailand it's it's probably far from it in and around the city but when you come out to the fields and see like this the rice fields people working you know you don't really see that in Chiang Mai if you go outside of Chiang Mai you do the town has grown on me but yeah I, I would come back here again I think to Pai for a nice little nice little break it's not too far either is it it's not too far to ride What I want to do is walk to the part where it opens up. On some of the other vlogs I've seen, seen where it was all open. It, I don't think I've crossed that bit yet. I'm going to walk to the end here because where I've been staying, I met this in English bloke. He said, "Keep walking to the end bit, and you will find something really good back here or something." So that's what we're doing. We're gonna walk to walk to this bit over here. Welcome. Open 7 a.m. to 5 p.m. Dear visitor, please return the bowl close here when you leave. Thank you. So you gotta wear appropriate clothing, but I think I'm okay. Nothing, 
nothing bad with meat. So, guessing this is some sort of temple. It's nice and shady up here anyway, which is cool, literally. Ah, please dress politely. I think we might have conquered the bamboo bridge, you know. I was expecting it to be longer. Somebody's going to say, it does carry on, Wayne. <laughs> they always do. I know somebody's going to say, that's just the beginning. But I can't see nowhere else where it goes on. So I'm going to walk back now. I have to come and see it. It's one of the most popular places here, right? And that's the whole point of this, this mission, was to have a bit of me time and do some vlogs. That's what keeps me happy at the minute, out with the camera, talking away. I would never come to places like this otherwise. I just wouldn't. I would probably just be in pie, in the room, out around the town not doing a whole lot. Same within Chiang Mai. Nice camera man. Ah, nice one buddy. <laughs> Is that a lot of people in out? good. A lot of people with the GoPros vlogging. That guy, what was he, Australian? <laughs> oh, I don't know. Woo, starting to heat up. The heat is on. The heat is on. It's on the street. What's nice about it is the views, really. And you can walk around, see the people working in the fields. That's well worth checking out. If you come here, you gotta check out the bamboo bridge, man without a doubt. Hello. Hello. Got this chap chilling out in the shade. Right guys, so I'm back at my new hotel now. And it's just a stone's throw away from the place where I stayed last night, the fishing bungalows. That's just two minutes up that way. Um, yeah, the, the place I had booked, something was up and they wasn't letting anybody stay. So I had to find a new place. I was coming back to the place that I stayed before, which was 800 baht a night. Yeah, so on the way down to the fishing place, which is just two minutes down this road. So I'm on the same road as this place, the Thai Resort. And I went in on the off chance because most things are booked. And yeah, they got some nice little bungalows and a lot cheaper than the other place as well. See, they got pie so good. And I prefer this one. This one is a lot cheaper. So I'll tell you the price in a bit. So you come in, look, you got all this space down here. You can park your bike over there. And they got a small restaurant here where you can get a drink and stuff like that. And reception. 
So that's a really nice place, right? And you got a little bar there, I'm not sure if it's open. And these are the small bungalows. <clears throat> and as soon as I seen it, I thought, yes, I'm gonna try this place. So it goes right up free. There's mine over there. I'm down near the front, number 13. That's a cool place, right? I wish I knew this one before. Well, I don't because I enjoyed the one yesterday, but it was just a little bit, little bit expensive. So you're not really close together as well. That's what I like, you know, not joined where they can hear you next door and it's very quiet here as well. I would have liked one at the back here, but all these are taken. But I'm happy down the front. So I'm gonna go and show you my room now. Forgot me sunnies. Got me sunnies in my room and it's really hot, but tonight it will be really cold again. Right, so cut across the grass. This is my little bungalow here, look. Absolute beauty. And I'm gonna show you around my new pad. Got my umbrella outside. I'd have to move it how the sun is now but earlier on it was blocking it and come into the new place this is it this is the new pad guys where's the where's the light can't find it <laughs> over here is it oh ah, it's over here yeah i've only been in here a matter of minutes so this is what 400 baht gets you simple simple bed simple room got the laptop out putting today's videos on there so they're all safe ready to edit you don't get a um, desk in here which is a bit of a bummer so I won't be able to do no editing in here too much you just get a basic basic um, bench like this look and a fan up there which I like the fan on the floor really so you can move it but I'm not too fussed because it's going to get cold later and I doubt if I'll even need it on got the mosquito net see really basic the 400 baht half the price of the one i stayed in last night and in here you got your small small bathroom shower sink toilet you know the drill people that's all that's all i need for a couple of nights you know and a cool little bed yeah i really like it here it's a hard mattress this one but for a couple nights 400 baht a night yeah happy days and straight outside my window look they're working in the fields so i thought that was cool i like that they're not making no noise it's, it's quite soothing you got the amazing mountain there yeah there it is got the policy checking 1 p.m. check out 11.30 if you want to rent a motorbike so you can rent a motorbike here you can tell, call a taxi to pick up you go I right, will take you to the rental stores anything I can help no smoking very basic but it'll do me lovely yeah I prefer it I prefer it then last night's one just down the road there if I knew this yesterday, I probably would have come to this one. Saved a little bit more money. This one's 400, so I'm happy with this. Right, Bobby Dazzler. So I'll probably stay in this one next time if I come. It's a really nice area. Yeah, so I'm not sure if I'm gonna stay one more night or two more nights. Might go and meet Sean from vlogging a dead horse tonight for a drink. That's, that could be the plan. Just go and have a quiet drink somewhere and have a chat about YouTube and stuff. And yeah, we shall see what tomorrow brings. So I'm gonna leave it there, guys, and I'm gonna get a shower in my new place here and freshen up, because I've been out all day sweating, sweating like a madman. So yeah, hope you're all safe and sound. Hope you're liking the pie vlogs. So I'm gonna stop waffling and I will see you in the next one. So take it easy, man. Take it easy.